Good morning, Hawks. Wake up. It's time for another morning announcement brought to you by Hawk News Live and the cast of Hawk TV. Good morning, Spruce Creek. Please stand for the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and, America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Spruce Creek. I'm Eliza Badano. And I'm Skylar Feast, and this is Hawk News Live from Monday, September 27th. The boys' golf team competed in the Volusia Flagler Tournament yesterday, coming in first place among all area high school teams in Volusia and Flagler counties. The Hawks were led by junior John Triplett, who shot an 18-hole round of two over par. Sophomore Connor Wolf was second, and juniors Seth Jolly and Thomas Burns came in third and fourth for the Hawks. Underclassmen photos are today. Please come during your English class to get your photos taken in the auditorium. If you are dual enrolled, you will need to come to the auditorium at some point during the day. Attention students, we have a second college coming to visit us on September 27th. Along with FAU, we will also have Florida Southern College here during lunch in the main atrium. Please make a note of it and plan on stopping by to see these two collegiate options for your consideration. Attention students interested in becoming a Florida State Seminole. A representative from Florida State University will be on campus to do a presentation after school on Thursday, September 29th from 2.45 to 3.15 in the auditorium. Make arrangements to stay after school and learn more about Florida State. There are several volunteer opportunities coming up. If you, a group of friends, or club would like to take one of these events, please stop by the activities office this week. Attention, if you are interested in trying out for the girls basketball team or becoming a manager, there will be a meeting on Tuesday, September 27th, 2016 in the gym during lunch. Please plan to attend in order to receive important information regarding tryouts next month. Reminder, there will be a short Mu Alpha Theta meeting in G3 today at lunch. Do you like to hammock? Do you like to hike? If so, join Spruce Creek's Hammocking and Hiking Club. The first meeting will be on Monday, October 3rd at lunch in 037 in Miss Richards' room. Get ready for some cool adventures because we know how to have a good time. Hola amigos, in honor of Hispanic Heritage Month today, we will tell you about a sport with Spanish roots that is played here in the United States. A sport with Hispanic roots played in the U.S. is high lot. It's played with a curved wicker basket called a cesta and a hard ball the size of a baseball but as hard as a golf ball. In its heyday during the 1960s to the 1990s, High Alive was played here in Daytona Beach, Orlando, Miami, and other Florida cities, as well as in Connecticut and Las Vegas. High Alive has long been considered the fastest ball game in the world. Congratulations to Mr. W for correctly answering Orlando as the U.S. city with the second highest concentration of Puerto Ricans outside of Puerto Rico. Please go to room C25 for your prize. Hasta mañana, amigos. You have studied the history of our world for years. Are you ready to step outside of your books and experience life? This June, Mrs. Murray and Miss Duncan will be taking a select group of up to 24 students to Ireland, England, and France. If you are interested in joining them, visit www.aworldbeyondbooks.weebly.com to find out more details, including the cost and itinerary. You can also come to C10 during lunch on Wednesday or Thursday or see Mrs. Murray in the Media Center anytime to find out more information. We will host a meeting for parents Thursday, September 29th at 6 p.m. in the Media Center. Please be sure to come if you are interested as there are limited spots available and they will fill up quickly. That's all for today. We'll see you in the news. And it's a great day to be a hawk. Apple take one, take one, Apple take one.